So what is this? Why are you releasing a 25th video? What is this? This is basically my gift to you. Merry Christmas, if you celebrate it. And I'm going to review. It is Yumochida's Merry Christmas. One, if not the best, Merry Christmas or Christmas-inspired song by a male Sayu. For, in my opinion, it is the best Christmas song by a male Sayu. So let's talk about this song because I love it and I want to share this with you. Notice the good vibes right off the start. That's something that Yumuchida has in all his music. Those good vibes. He wants to listen to more of his music because he does make sure that that energy, those feelings, those emotions pass through the performances that he delivers. And the music actually matches that or those emotions in a really awesome way. Notice as well that the vocals are heavily processed. They are edited with a bit of auto-tune go going on in there. However, it's not going to remain like that because this is a song all about R&B performance and because of that, Yumuchi is going to deliver a really awesome performance in here that is incredibly melodic, really groovy and slightly alluring yet with a really cutesy twist. So clean his vocal, so clean, and that bass line is perfect as a contrast to his voice. The strings hits from disco music are there. The funky guitar riffs that seem like the end of the summer that are really cozy, really warm are there. The fancy Rhodes piano that is playing since the start. The punchy bass line that is deliberately slow paced and cozy. Really intimate in a way. They are all creating a really cozy and intimate soundscape for you and another person. This is really, really a cozy, really sweet song. And a big reason why I enjoy this song a whole lot is how there is a really good balance between slightly inviting, at the same time, slightly cutesy vibes. Those two are together and they are quite charming as you listen to this song. Forget all the Mariah Carey's and Michael Bublé's and Frank Sinatra's in the world, Yumuchida's Merry Christmas should be the song playing in your home during Christmas, non-stop. <laughs>
how in this song you are constantly moving and when you get to this part you are actually moving towards your home and towards that cozy environment that you consider home it is really 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 cool how he accomplishes that through the composition and of course his performance you are almost hopping to home hopping home and uh celebrating that and feeling really excited about it you can feel that excitement in his performance <laughs> It's a really, really awesome um, reverbed guitar solo. It's really sweet and it matches the tone of the song. It's also a really with a funky twist in there. It's quite emotional and it serves as a perfect cherry on top of this song that is flawless on all ends. Do notice that Yomuchi is uh, performing as a tenor, he is a tenor, and his performance is really, really sweet, but he never uh, raises his tone, he is making sure that he is consistent throughout with his sweetness and his tone, he is not raising too much his uh, tone or lowering too much his tone, he will do that slightly in the next part, but that's not a big issue and that's not a massive change, it's actually to make you resonate even better with the feelings in this song and then you are yet again embraced in a really cozy hug for the the last part in this song <laughs> That's a lot of legato. Da! He's adding a lot of legato intentionally to make the song sound even fancier. Notice those ad libs going on in the background. Yumuchi is showing that he can fill in silence on the vocal end with so many awesome things that add a really awesome dynamic to this performance. <laughs> The song wrapping up in a fade out, which is something that is really old school uh, and it's not done anymore, is a really nice touch. It reminds me of those Christmas songs from the 90s. Yet again, I said this uh, midway through the song, forget the Mariah Carey's, the Michael Bublé's and the Frank Sinatra's that you listen to all the time during Christmas. You have Yumuchida's Merry Christmas, that is, in my opinion, 100 times better than any of those songs. Iconic? Not. It's not iconic as those songs, but it's 
really really awesome it is a good song to have playing in the background time and time again it doesn't get tiring because of its relaxed vibe it's really cozy vibe it's really a sweet song with a really nice intimate vibe it feels like a warm hug after a long day it really is sweet and filled with love it's really really awesome song so i wanted to suggest this song as a special entry here in the review advent calendar making it the 25th entry in this series to thank you all for supporting this channel for actually participating in this series there's more next year so do look out for announcements when it is close to the time that i need you to participate uh, of course, subscribe to the channel if you feel like it. You can also follow the Hand That Feeds HQ on social media. You will find links in the description. And of course, the Hand That Feeds HQ does have a Discord server. It is a really chill server. It's more to share your love for 2D music and Seiyu music than anything else. So if you are one of those people that want to share their love for 2D music and Seiyu music, do join in the server. Of course, I'm not as active in that server as I want to be, but still there are awesome people in there that love music and want to talk with you about all things Say You and to the music. And of course, Merry Christmas to you. And of course, if you celebrate it and Happy New Year, we'll see each other very soon, I hope. And of course, there will be several uh, features coming to the channel in the next couple of days, but I will be away for a couple of days as well. And I will not be monitoring anything here or on the website for a couple of days to actually take some time off. Still, uh, there will be podcast episodes nonstop uh, being released. Those drop every Friday and you have the features on every Monday. And... With that being said, thank you very much for your support, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you for making this review Advent Calendar 2022 edition really awesome. And I'll see you guys soon. <laughs>